why don't you talk about the symmetry tool? Word, today we're gonna talk about the symmetry tool in Sketchable. This is Digital Drawing and Sketchable with DTM, that's me. And today we're gonna talk about the Symmetry Tool in Sketchable app. Let's get started by opening our Sketchable app, available from the Microsoft Store on all Windows 10 devices. And today we're gonna have some special fun and by testing out the Symmetry Tool in Sketchable. Now, I am a character artist, concept artist, a lot of 2D illustrations, and one thing I don't do much is to play around and exploring uh, just the creativity of some of these tools that are in Sketchable. So here we go. Let me turn that off again so I can resize the screen. Turn on the, the um, symmetry tool and I can add or take away different parts. So if I want a symmetry tool that's, oh, here we go. Ha, ah, yes. Nice. Whoa, got a nice little butterfly. Or I can do a four part. And let me go ahead and change my layer. Can I do that? Come on, layer. There we go. Add a new layer. Turn that one off. And now I can try. Let me go ahead and play with this. There we go. Yes, 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 yes. So. What if I was doing something else? Whoa. Whoa. Nice. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Hold on. Now let's try the next one. Oh yeah, the snowflake. It looks like a snowflake. It's called, yeah, it is the snowflake symmetry. Now let's go like this. What? Look at this. Wow. Okay, 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 okay. Let's keep playing. It's gonna, I'm, I'm just testing all of these different symmetry tools. And uh, we started with the vertical flip, horizontal flip, the mirror two axis, Snowflake, and now we'll try the rotational symmetry. <laughs> Very similar to this one. I don't see um, big difference. So I'm gonna have to keep testing it out and see what happens. And now here I can turn off the eyeball and it still has the symmetry tool on, but you don't have to necessarily see it. Oh, there's the settings right here. And so I'm using, what if I use, turn that off and on. Oh, I can see, I can see the different, oh, oh, I see. So look, the big difference between the, the, um, the, the mirror two axis versus the rotational is that I get more sectors if I want. Look at that. Oh, 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 oh. Nice. Okay, let's go now. Let's go. Figured it out. Figured it out, y'all. Nice. So then I can kind of go like this. It is. This is cool. That's amazing. I like it. Nice. I just had to do. All I had to do was click on the settings, and of course, I know the settings are here. But do I do I click on stuff and see what's happening? No. Hmm. So pin down. That means it's not going to move on me, and I can then rotate the canvas without messing with the symmetry. Nice, I like that. And of course I can turn off the symmetry and then keep on working. 
Beautiful. Wow. Very cool. Now I just need to know what the death cut does. I can still, like I can erase any part I want. But what could I cut? Oh, it cuts. It won't let me go from one sector to another. <laughs> I got it. Wow, imagine the fun that I've been missing out on when it comes to the symmetry tool. This is amazing. Who would have thunk it? Sketchable did. Thank you, Sketchable. This is Digital Drawing and Sketchable with DTM. I hope that today's tips are helpful in expanding your digital drawing creativity. Please like, share, and subscribe for more Sketchable insights. Until next time. Come here, you. Come here.